you know, guys, I do videos, yeah? Like, I do these YouTube videos, and hopefully it's something that I can make into a full-time thing at some point. And when I started out, the quality of them was terrible. The information in them was awesome, but the quality of them wasn't very good. I didn't know how to speak on camera. To be fair, I still do get a little bit, like, tongue-tied and a little bit like... Oh, what am I doing when it comes to speaking on camera? And man, you should see me when it comes to doing stuff in public. Like, I will not talk in public to this camera at all. And I'm really going to have to try and get over that because I do want to do a lot more vlogs. But I feel like when I've had a break, I just go back to square one. Like, I've this is like the third, like, take right now of just trying to do the intro. Freaking sucks. I've been in the world. What is popping guys and welcome back to another tattoo tips video. Today's video however is not going to be a tattoo tips video. What we are doing is we are going to be unboxing this machine right here. It is the Hummingbird Rotary Bronk tattoo machine and it is a pen style machine. So all we're going to be doing today guys is just unboxing, see what's inside, get my initial impressions. We will have a full review up of this machine ASAP when I have fully used it and, and put it through its paces. This machine was sent to me by the guys over at Big Wasp Tattoo Supply in the US. Now to say we have COVID, to say it was Christmas, and to say that it was overseas, props to those guys because they got this machine sent out pretty damn quick from speaking to them and from the machine being here in my hand now it has not taken long at all so big shout out to those guys i do feel truly blessed when supply companies do send me little little care packages so thank you so much anyway guys let's get right into the unboxing let's go all right guys let's do this just get my trusty unboxing youtube knife <laughs> That's not a knife. Because everybody's got to have a unboxing knife. So what do we do with this? Right there. Start there. Right, let's see what's in it, shall we? Ooh, suspense, bosh. So we have the product instructions. So product instructions right there. And then we have, boom. Okay, so first impressions. Um, it does have some weight to it. It definitely does have a little bit of weight to the machine. It's not overly heavy too much, but it does feel with the battery pack a little bit top heavy. But as I've said before, I do like a top heavy machine. Um, I feel like it helps me get the, uh, the motion of my technique down a lot, lot better. Color is pretty nice. So when we turn the... You know the grip the grip feels pretty nice there's um there's quite a bit of tension there there's not like a lot of tension or anything but there's enough for it to not be turning around um when you are using the the machine it uses just typical normal batteries which yep it uses one 3.7 volt battery. Just put that back in. So it actually, like the vibration is actually not that bad neither. Like that's on 7.2 at the minute. 
six. Seems to me like the optimum running speed for it might be around about seven. That sounds that sounds about right. How do you charge it? Um, oh, so you can actually replace it with an RCA connector also. So let's just have a look. See if there's one in the bottom. Holy shit. Yes, there is. Look at that. Okay, so this is the RCA converter head, the battery, the battery charger, and the data line, which probably means RCA connector, maybe, um, RCA cord maybe. But that is all you get in the box, guys, which it's pretty good to be, to be fair. So there we have it guys, there is the Hummingbird Bronc unboxing. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty sure guys, the, rev the full review for this machine will be up next week um, after I've used the machine and I'll, I'll let you know my thoughts in that video, I'll go over the price um, and go over all the relevant details. But anyway guys, I shall see you all in the next video. Peace.